Pinoy, we're gonna make a peach cobbler. It's easy. We only have like a few ingredients. Of course, peaches, sliced peaches, one stick of melted butter, and our yellow cake mix. This is our yellow cake mix. You could use any brand that you like, your favorite brand of cake mix. This is an easy way to make peach cobbler. I don't know how you're gonna call it. Maybe you call it something different, but this is how I call it, peach cobbler. So what we're gonna do is, we're gonna put our mix here. The mix here. All we have to do is mix it all together. Two cups of, two cans of peaches one and two one cup melted butter or it's one stick one stick of melted butter and then the mix requires one cup of water since the um, Peaches has water already. I will just put like three fourth cup. Okay. Okay. This is water. It's less than uh, one cup of water. That's it. Then all we have to do is mix. If you want it sweeter, you could add a little sugar. But the mix is has already sugar, and the uh, can of peaches is is sweet also. I use heavy heavy syrup. So this is what we're gonna do, we just mix it like this and then we bake it. Just like that. Mix, mix, mix lang. Um. So we just mix the pits. Mix, pits cobbler mix. With the wheat ingredients, you could do like the, the what do you call this one? The flour, then the cake mix, and the water, and you could blend it. But for me, I'll just do like this. Mix it all, mix it all. Bango, this smells so good. Pits cobbler. I call this pits cobbler. What do you call this, guys? You call it this different recipe to what? Okay. Think this is it. Tokens is good. I don't put anything. I don't even put vanilla. It smells so good already. The cake mix doesn't uh, call for a vanilla, so I will not put vanilla. No vanilla, guys. Yeah, this is good. And we're gonna bake it for 350 degrees until uh, we taste it if with a toothpick and if there's no more. If there's nothing is sticking on the toothpick, that means it's cooked. All right. Okay. The oven is preheated. It's already 350 degrees. It's hot now. So let's go for it. Just wanna make even la merong pictures yan sa mga gilid gilid para hindi concentrated sa gitna naman. Kawawa naman yung hindi makakuha ng pictures. All right, this is good. I love pizza cobbler. Pizza cobbler, guys. It's masarap. We like masarap food. Okay. Maybe we're gonna put it in the smaller, in the lower rack. Oh, so we'll check it. It's hot. All right. We're baking pizza cobbler, okay? 
We'll check it later. Guys, let's check it. Okay, let's check it. It's brown already on top, so I'm sure it's cooked already. Ooh, it's hot. See? Yeah, it's cooked. No more. No, it's clean now. There. It's clean. Yeah, I think it's cooked. We'll take it up now. Hey guys, this is our pit scabbler. It's out of the oven. We will have to let it cool it a little bit for at least 10 minutes. Then we could slice it and taste it. Man, looks good. This is pit scabbler. You know what? I made the. I did not put the. I forgot to spray the the pan. So I hope it will not stick. But looks like fluffy. Mm -hmm looks good good all right let's cool it for 15 minutes then we're gonna taste it i'm sure it's so good pizza cobbler